Hey guys, how's it going? Kriparian here. Today I want to give you guys a video about Dwarven Realms. So this is a sponsored video. I did a segment on Twitch with this game and uh, it really surprised me in a few different ways. Now the preface is pretty important here. So um, it is a game that is made by two twin brothers very much as a passion project. It's not like a studio. It's not like a big game developer thing. They really just wanted to make a really cool and really fun game there way and it really shows it's a game that plays kind of like an ARPG it's probably closest to one um, and you basically get constant upgrades and face more and more challenging encounters but the pacing of the game um, is just like you know it's just like killing loads tons of monsters constantly just aoeing them down it's like it's like really like blasting and that experience is the one key experience that people who play ARPGs often strive for so this game absolutely delivers on it and it kind of has that like old school raw gaming aspect to it i know some of you guys are going to love this game so if you do want to check it out i do have a link for it below it's like five bucks on steam and uh yeah hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video and um, I mean from what I've seen so far it looked really cool oh that's the that's the character name oh okay oh we, we RNG'd into Drake okay we could do that crit and life steal max health health regen crit damage against mobs and bosses attack speed move speed okay that so dexterity is pretty good how much experience gains from everything level one So this doesn't really take anything. Oh, so those those things are good to hit. Oh, that's that's my new ability. You. Okay. These things were giving me stuff, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go around and get the stuff. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna group them up and then Q. Q. Proceed to the rupture statue and face my minion. Okay, that worked pretty well actually. Oh, you can break the rock. Oh, you can break like everything. Okay. Doesn't seem like those things have anything in them, though. <laughs> okay, so this is a skill tree. Available points, 7. Life by 20. Increase health regen. We want the energy regen. And the base damage buff. Forge ingots. Like, be there? No. Uh, well, I don't have gloves, so getting gloves sounds good. I guess I have to get staff skill, right? If I... So I, I should just... I should just use it right now, then. Even though it's a lot worse. Oh, that's pretty cool, though. So that's, like, not melee. How come I'm not getting fire? Oh, there it is, the fire aura. Fight me. I don't know what I'm doing with the, the green stuff. Oh, dude. Okay, you do not want to get surrounded. Jesus. But I'm going to get, like, fireball-type stuff eventually, right? No mercy. Okay, we got, we got to get our magic skill up. When we get, like, the first Q, it probably won't suck, right? Yeah, Q is like the volley. It takes like quite a bit of mana, and it kind of like locks me in place. It's just, uh, it's just like rapid firing my main attack. So it's not, it's not like a crazy skill. Uh, I guess it's pretty good in order to like proc stuff. 
the game has some kind of like skill mastery based on your weapons. So because I, I just swapped to this staff. Oh, so you got another skill. What does this do? Yeah, that's pretty good. That's like a clear skill, I guess. Okay, we, we may have upset the neighborhood here, killing all their trees and stuff. Where are my meteors, though? I want some meteors. Proceed to the rupture statue and face my minion. Uh oh. Oh. Okay, getting surrounded is not good. Why did I lose my weapon? Did I? Oh, okay, yeah, I, I weapon swap because I'm a dumbass and panicked. Okay. We got two rare mobs now. Okay. Justice will prevail. Okay, so R is charged. Let's see what that means, because I'm not too hopeful on it being particularly good. Yeah, that was... Oh, wait, that actually did a lot of damage. Okay. Uh, I guess I'm good. Let's go do the boss. Oh. Can I hit these web things? No. Cannot unlock. Why not? I guess I don't have a bone key. Bow. 22 damage bow. Are you serious? Got a bone key. Okay, fine. I mean, I'll take a recipe for a helmet, because I don't even have a helmet. Change what? Be a charged blast. Oh boy. Okay, full, full surround. Full surround charged blast. Yeah, it does not look very good. Okay, we got a rare mob over here. Okay, we got another rare mob over here. I don't think I've been here yet. Oh, that's where that's where I came in from, actually. I've definitely been in there. Okay. Well, it doesn't look like mobs can spawn behind, so... Oh, that's a mount? I have a mount? Oh, okay. This V. Oh, that's the charged dash. Oh, okay. Electric dragon's damage. We don't have that. But it has like good crit chance, luck, arcane damage bonus. Okay, sure. I don't know what luck does. So my damage is really bad, but. I have a meteor proc, so I stack a bunch of mobs on the same spot, and then I do the rapid fire ability, and it's like proccing a meteor, kind of. Well, not always, which is, which is a little problematic sometimes, but for the most part it seems to work, kind of. See, that's like the meteor, the, the, the fire coming down. That, that actually does a lot of damage. And I'm trying to kind of keep my abilities consistent. I'm trying to keep them all fire. Because every like five levels you get like a thing. And that has like a school of magic built in. So I feel like if I use a bunch of fire abilities and I keep juicing up fire. I can keep putting points in like wisdom. Which is like more experience. Oh, 
wolf statue. Okay. Oh, I can't dive through. It's taking like no damage. have that recipe okay what hockey is blink it doesn't have a cooldown it's v for charged dash it just takes a lot of energy but my special attack takes very little energy and we're specced into energy so i can blink a whole lot if i need to and for bosses they uh oh no i want to i want to no 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 stop how do i stop Where's cancel? Cancel! No! I don't want ten gloves! I did- Oh no. Wait, I got a legendary? Wait, you can make legendaries? Carnage of fire damage. Rain of flames. I think rain of flames is what I actually use. Oh, what the hell? Dude, that guy just clocked me from the inside. Whoa, what's 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 that? <laughs> okay. Level 13 legendary or something. And it's lightning damage, unfortunately, but it's also got like 40 attack speed, so I think I'm okay with, with that. Damn that glory. I think my damage is a lot higher, and I don't think it's like the crit. I think the chest had like 40 attack speed. I think the Q ability might do like a channel for a duration, and your attack speed is essentially a damage multiplier, which effectively makes it a proc multiplier as well. So there's there's ranged mobs now. For those we might actually have to focus down a little bit. Yeah, the Nova's really good. Oh. Uh, do I get to keep my loot? Oh, I do. Oh, okay. I don't know if I got like stunned or something. I'm go I'm going in ten again. Going ten again. Nova was real good. But relax, relax. Yeah, the game's pretty cool. That's no good. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, see, there is a stun. I just saw myself getting stunned. There's so many mobs coming in. I guess that's kind of the, the difficult part. You want to, like, squeeze out the last few seconds, which means the the better boss damage you have, the, the better you are at, like, farming these levels then. Yes, that's what that would have to mean. Yeah, I think it's I think it's time to get going here. Easy. 